Apomipe, program for the support of micro and small enterprises in Peru. Constructing enterprise networks to reduce poverty and social inequality through sustainable businesses. Innovation for local economic development. Building enterprise networks. Numerous international experiences have demonstrated that to generate sustainable well-being, the key is collective action and the interaction with the enterprise and its institutional environment. In the Apomipe program, we have already seen excellent results in the joining of small producers. The program promotes association focused towards businesses through the formation of enterprise networks. These networks group small producers that are united to gain greater success and competitiveness in the demands of the market. Apomipe uses an adaption to rural means of the methodology Enterprise Networks, which has been widely applied by Minker in several regions of the country. This methodology consists of six phases. Phase 1 – Analysis of Territories, Chains and Lines of Business In order to assure that a project will be successful, we must analyze the territories where the planned business activity will take place and find the productive chains with the most potential in the market. This focus on demand permits the identification of small producers interested in taking advantage of a concrete business opportunity. In September of 2005, the Apomipi program arrived in Tambo Real, a beautiful farming community in the district of Zurite, in the province of Anta, 40 minutes from the city of Cusco. In the zone we found a considerable number of small dairy farmers who sold their milk in the community and at a local Saturday market. Phase 2 – Promotion and Selection In Tamborreal, we were six ganaderos verdaderamente comprometidos para invertir esfuerzo, tiempo, dinero en el trabajo conjunto y así mejorar nuestro negocio. Nos convencemos de las ventajas de trabajar en red. Porque en la red logramos mayor productividad, aumentan las ventas, los costos bajan. Es más fácil adquirir maquinarias, capacitación, asesoramiento técnico, trabajando en red. Tenemos más poder de negociación con clientes y proveedores. Por eso formamos la red de productores lácteos en la comunidad de Tamborreal. Nos reunimos semanalmente acompañados por un articulador del programa POMIP. Ellos toman sus decisiones, son dueños de su proceso. Nuestra labor es la de articular a los grupos y demostrar las ventajas del trabajo en conjunto. Ellos entran en un proceso de autoselección a lo largo de todo su proceso de articulación. Es de vital importancia identificar al líder de la red y a los aliados territoriales como son gobiernos locales, otras ONGs y empresas privadas. Phase 3. Generating confidence and planning improvements. For the purpose of generating confidence in the group, the Apomipe program organizer promoted technical training, visits to each one of the dairy farmers' facilities to know their businesses. He also organized workshops to analyze the strengths and weaknesses, internships and visits to companies in the same businesses, as well as activities of camaraderie for the group. Tenemos una confianza con mis compañeros, por eso decimos una empresa. Si no tendríamos una confianza, no trabajaríamos juntos. Constituted as a network, the dairy farmers of Tambo Real established internal procedures and created a common foundation for the basis of their weekly monetary contributions. Soon, with the aid of the organizer, they identified specific problems in the businesses and determined concrete solutions to solve them. All of this was laid out in a plan of improvement, a key instrument to carrying out a fast and effective process of change. 
Phase 4 Consolidation of Confidence Pilot Projects It was time to show that the dairy farmers of Tambo Real could work together. Because of that, they decided to create two small low-cost projects with which they would have tangible results for the businesses in the short term. El silo construimos porque tenemos poca cantidad de terreno. Es la mejor manera de guardar el pasto para tiempo de sequía y para que no baje la cantidad de la leche. La construcción de las salas de ordeño fue el proyecto piloto priorizado y ejecutado por la red de Tambor Real. Los proyectos pilotos son proyectos de bajo costo y de rápidos resultados en aspectos claves del negocio. Nosotros como Pomipe acompañamos, asesoramos y cofinanciamos estos proyectos pilotos. Las redes deben demostrar responsabilidad en el manejo de los recursos humanos, económicos y disponibles durante su ejecución. Phase 5. Design and Implementation of Strategic Project. Using improved techniques of hygiene and quality was the moment that the farmers of Tambo Real amplified their market. And there was no better place to do this than at their own point of sale. For this, they had to acquire a cooling tank and a milk dispenser. 30% of this investment was covered by the network, and the Apomipe program covered the rest. Phase 6. Support in the management of the business. After a lot of effort, the Tambo Real network obtained its own point of sale in the mega supermarket the most prestigious in the city of Cusco, which received more than 2,000 clients a day. Al día vendemos 180 litros de leche fresca. Con eso estamos llegando a la meta que nos hemos trazado. Aún queremos vender más. But the Tambo Real network is not satisfied with its success. It wants to continue growing. Queremos mejorar nuestros envases, promocionar la leche, comprar otro dispensador para poder vender en otros locales de supermercado el Mega. Por eso, con la ayuda del programa Apumipe hemos contratado una gerente. Nosotros como red tenemos como objetivo principal el de generar nuestros propios ingresos para autosostenernos y cada vez depender menos del apoyo de programas como Apumipe. Like Tambo Real, the Apomipe program supports more than 400 small and micro producers in 36 other networks. The network of mango producers in La Merced, thanks to adequate pests control, increased its annual income by 35%. The network of flower producers in Paraíso de Chitapampa increased their annual income with the construction of a greenhouse to produce flowers out of season. The network of producers of guinea pigs in Chiang reduced feed costs by 50%. To this date, the Apomipe program has promoted and implemented 44 pilot projects of enterprise networks with an investment of $146,000, of which 41% has been contributed by the networks. In addition, an investment of $600,000 in 34 strategic projects is being considered. Of this investment, 47% will be contributed by the networks. Lo principal es ganamos ya confianza entre nosotros y así garantizamos nuestro producto. En Tambor Real ya sabemos trabajando juntos, con el esfuerzo podemos llegar a muy lejos. APOMIPE, a program of the Swiss Agency for Development and Cooperation and the Ministry of Labor and Employment Promotion, 
executed in three departments of Peru for the Swiss Foundation into cooperation and the Peruvian NGO Minca. The execution is realized thanks to alliances with local institutions, Cedepas Norte in Cajamarca, Asodeco Peru in Cusco, and Minca in La Libertad. <laughs>